Welcome back to City Bus Manager. It's your friendly neighborhood bus driver, Ant. How the devil are you all? I hope you're well. It's been a while since we sat down and actually looked at City Bus Manager, a place where we started our adventure on this channel uh, from recording to uh, making videos. And obviously, there's some new DLC out. Um, Steam doesn't allow me to pay it at the moment. Um, but yeah, we're going to look at one of the um, scenarios. I have a scenario that I am working on called Rebuilding Rosendale uh, Bus Company. Um, but I'm having some issues getting it to actually load. Um, so I thought today we would play uh, London on the collapse. Croydon. Uh, London is facing transport crisis after a massive budget cut. It's up to you to get buses back on track. Keep the buses running, maintaining, calm disgruntled passengers. Uh, support your team, expand the network, increase satisfaction and maximize profits in 21 days. Future of public transport is in your hands. Can we, the ever vescent friendly neighborhood bus driver, improve London transport? So we just had all this. Um, let's just quickly pause. So a quick look around. Okay, so this is our garage. I do like this. Oh, that is interesting. I never thought of doing something like that. Okay, okay. That is really interesting. And again, I never really thought about doing the toilets like that. Oh, okay. Maybe I should really pay more attention. So what have we got in this? So what have we got in the form of buses? Let's have a look. Uh, bus fleet. Uh, we've got 10 buses, all using the new route master. In depot, we... Do we have shift schedule? We do have shift schedule. Uh, right, so we've got all that. Uh, what's our money like? What's our utilizations? So 12% of willingness to use the transportation in the industry. Tickets are... We don't have loans. We've got 200,000. Right. Let's bring the prices right down. Daily Rover to 550. And a weekly ticket to £21. We're going to take some inspiration from Manchester. Uh, let's go to the depot. Right. So we have... Wow, that's a big route, isn't it? Okay. So let's look at our statistics. Let's look at our bus routes. The 194. From West Croydon. I know nothing about London. Like I have. I've not really lived in London. I've worked in London. Uh, I spent some time in London with some family. Uh, so I know very little about London. Um, especially thingy numbers. But. I reckon we want to be looking at somewhere down here, maybe. Let's have a look. Hmm. Okay. So let's have a look at this short timetable. So they're every 20 minutes. Okay. So we got one, two, one, two, three, four, five. Seven, eight, nine, ten buses. Inbox, 61% of all your income. That's not a great deal. Uh, right, shift scheduler. So, how many? Uh, all bus, 11 buses are being used. And one assignment missing. Okay, so technically we need 12 buses. Uh, and fit that onto anything. We cannot fit that onto anything. So we are going to need an extra bus. Okay, buy a new bus. Okay, we don't have any decker door deckers. Right, that's going to be difficult. So we're going to research. Um. Research both of these. Right. Um, what I might do then is be willing to drop that tour. 
what do we have on the side of the buses up to upgrade? Nothing. So we definitely want to start. Hmm. What are we looking like on parts? Staff. I thought it's staff. So Twelve bus drivers. Okay. Right. Okay. That's fine. Let's run the first day. See what Tuesday brings us. Let's have a look at staff and employees. Work schedule settings. No. So we've got 12 bus drivers, three mechanics, one researcher, two cleaners, two service, two ticket inspectors. I've never had a ticket inspector yet. 21 days, sell 10,000 tickets. Catch 250 passengers without tickets, earn 50 trophies. Right. Let's fire this up. Okay, we have London buses, but we don't have any more London buses, so. The paint shop up there. Space for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more buses. So we're going to order ten buses. Tune through finances, so we've got 46 quid. Electricity, staff. Fuel. So I. We'll decline that route because we can't assist them. We haven't got a vehicle for them to assist. Um, so yeah, it's been a while since we played one of these, uh, played a, a city bus manager game on stream, uh, on um, for YouTube. Um, I was hoping that we could test and show off our new one, but unfortunately, like I said, we just cannot get it to open the file. Right, it's so 107 people that can fit on this one. What oh, time is it? Okay, so we're going to sell 20 tickets, so we've reduced the pr pricing of, of that straight away just to, to help bring people on board. We've sold one ticket. Amen. And that's the right way to go about it. Um, right, let's run this loop. Let's see how we do. I've um I've only been on a bus like twice in London. Um, very much much a, uh, a tube guy. Just go on the tube all the time. Um, it's not something I've. Uh... Yeah. So do we have to request a ticket inspector? Yeah, let's request two ticket inspectors to run these services. Um. So yeah, I've not really um spent much time. On um on buses in London, I I plan to go down to London and obviously spend some time in London, probably next year now. Um, and go from there, uh, and and do some tours, so because I know there are some like fantastic little routes to do. I uh, just yeah, always find it like I'm going somewhere to uh, get somewhere, the tube's a lot quicker. But I suppose if I'm going down the city. Um, something different, then yeah. That's fine. We'll uh, definitely try. This is a long route. The second bus passes. Okay, so we're not filling up, up. That's uh, not too bad. Imagine if we were filling up like straight away, because like there's a lot of the problems sometimes with the um, uh, with our with when we do city bus manager games, we. I always seem to be really busy, so maybe the scenarios had some settings cut back. It's relatively on time, it hasn't really dropped. Just one there dropped a minute. So they're all going down plus one minute, plus zero. So we should catch back up. One minute's not too bad because I'm assuming we have standing time. 
assuming it's down here. Right. So we did that one straight away. That's good. Three buses left over. Um, I'm going to hire another researcher. Um, wow. Just to see if we can smash out that these researchers as quick as possible. Right, so the game was automatically saved. Wow, you went five. Oh god, you went five minutes down. Right, um cross route. So we'll just edit the timetable. One, two, three, four, five. Just put five minutes in. Six, seven, eight. Eight minute rest. Right, so it is making money for us. Uh, at least we're working away. Uh, we can't do that just yet. We don't have spur buses. Um, we don't really have. I don't want to buy new small used buses because I feel like they're going to be a problem straight away. Um, I mean, like, the biggest bus we've got is a dart. Bringing darts back would be cool. Um, but they're not twin doors, so, yeah. Uh, definitely want to get up there and get some extra buses. So, let's run this day quick as possible. Then we've got finances. We're not, we're not doing too bad. We're making a small profit. Inspectors. Both on eleven quid. Only city. Still the electrical one is that unlocks. We haven't cancelled any tours yet. Oh crap. <laughs> Uh, complete 10 successful tours. Let's just see what this. Why? Oh, new buses. What's 10 buses going to cost us? Uh, right. We are going to need maybe two loans. 55 minutes to the service center? Barrel City 400. Right, let's quickly take an investment loan. And we're going to put that into the bus fleet. And we're going to go uh, red. Slight issue is we don't have pantograph charges, do we? So, outdoor. Uh, we have to go into a little bit of debt. Right. 
right, so massive debt. It's a new bus route. Where is that place? Where is that place? Where is that town? So that's a deep hole. The crowding's there. This way. Just trying to think how to get these. This might be the longest. Bus route ever. To I just spelled Croydon right. I don't want people in the comments being like, "You spelled Croydon wrong." Croydon. Uh, every twenty minutes. Right, so late. Right now, um, where is that bus route? Any route? Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Is there a way for him? That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Probably just gonna need some staff now, aren't we? So bus drivers, hire employees, bus drivers. Wow, the economy. 
for it. Just hire as many people as we can. We're at 100k in debt. Right, ninety thousand pounds in debt, but we have electric buses, which right uh, is part of probably something. Crucial sure bus network is twelve to two percent. That's fine. Um, do you know what I'm also going to do? I'm going to hire. Ticket inspectors. Get them out there. Screw it. Go by. It's got a bad battery anyway. Right, so we're massively in debt, uh, which is good because. We just put a huge investment of 690,000 and we got paid that back. I think day one, I'm making seven grand, 13 quid revenue, 13 grand revenue. Everyone's kicking off about here. Our bus route is quite dramatically increased. Uh, request ticket inspector. Uh, bus routes. So I'm just going to edit. Edit timetable. No, we're doing that one. Edit timetable. Advanced settings. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's ten minutes since the route. So they're much busier than ones already, aren't they? Right, 20 minutes late. I don't know if it's just because of the delay of setting off. <laughs> oh, that one's probably the delay of setting off, isn't it? 195, is it? So we've done the tickets. That's good. Let's tick that one off. Let's get a bit of a charge. These are mega full. It's a jerky there, isn't it? It's something jerky there. Jerky jerky. I don't know what point uh, it goes. Huh, you can't afford to run this company. <laughs> We're taking your buses back. Oh, but no. These are clean. 
So we nearly done the 20 tours. That's good. Uh, yeah, London buses, very punctual. Yeah, we're getting there, aren't we? Damn footprint. Got 40% e buses. Oh, we should have got 50%, shouldn't we? Because we've got. You know, 10 out of 10, realistically. Uh, yeah. This one your tours is complete. Halfway through selling the tickets, so that's gonna be good. What we brought in for tick revenue 33,000. So that's not bad. Five and a half grand for fines, so that's working out. That should balance out with the staff, so that's paying for the staff. The fines are paying for the staff. It's good repairs and maintenance, 40 fuel. Electricity, that's fine. Rent is the cost. Rent's low. That's good. Uh, ticket inspectors. Fourteen pound an hour. So that's just going to bring that up a little bit. So sixty thousand, six thousand for, for that. that. That's covering like the wage bill. That's good. That's that's a good. Um, fifteen quid for novices. Oh, that's a good wage. That's gonna kick off because I bet that's just undone a lot of work. <laughs> Clean, Clean. Uh, just gonna kind of hire. No, I need to buy one more locker. Um, I might just leave that. Right? This is like I could unlock something, but oh, this is like a cavern. What can I unlock then? Right, she's scheduling for tomorrow. Go forty four to Still one bus short. I don't get that. Hmm. Let's look at the timetables. Why are the cleaners <laughs> quickly need to build another locker office break room locker? Right. 
Alright, works good with the cleaners. We're starting to rebuild the empire. Can't have holidays. We've only got, we've got a spare bus driver. I'm not worried about uh, washing them just yet. I think we'll clean them every night. I've never seen those shelves. So we smashed the bronze one, 10,000 tickets in one day. Sweet, we've gone for that. Right, and we're going into the second day worth of service. We have 59,000. So yesterday we made 38,000. Staff costs, revenue of 47. Staff costs was 7 RAF. So we're paying most that with our. What do you call it? We have. Loans of I think a seventy thousand pound loan is needed. Uh loans of three and a half grand. Yeah, it's it's not looking huge, but I think realistically we're we're in the right traction area. <clears throat> Cause we're hitting most of our targets. I reckon we'll hit that 24,000 passengers today. Not a problem. Ticket inspector should be in anyway. This is ideal time for catching people misusing the buses. Let's run day two, see how day two goes. I do think the plan for the next bit of bus network is maybe a bus from Croydon. Just going up here and looping round. Or going up here and going around the housing estate. It just requires having a bit more money. In fact, we could build it, couldn't we?
You gotta bring it this way around the loop. Just wait so we can afford uh, that. And that's basically then like a massive loop just around Croydon. But there's a weird little turn around around the top. Don't ask why. So that'd be funny. I'm refueling it, doesn't need refueling. Very demanding employees, aren't they? Very demanding. We need to also expand, don't we? We don't have any bus park. Revenue inspectors are already out there. I'm hoping to find more revenue today for us. Uh, price is a bit too high. What's the ticket? I mean, like, plus a thousand realistically. It's 777. the longest wait time I've ever seen for a service center. Where are those? Uh, oh, holy crap. Oh, they don't have a... It must just work. How many service center employees I have? What is this high moral? What are high more employees of then? Right. Or is that? I don't know times Natasha has complained. Let's quickly <laughs> I'm just gonna <laughs> Build some um, lockers. Hire a shit ton of service employee staff. Which I thought I did. Well, they're not going to come in. It's gonna take a short minute to uh are these all operational.
Wow, they ain't gonna get a dinner breakfast, right, are they? But finance wise, it's bringing in a lot more money than anticipated. Let's put some fuel in these things as well, guys. And we're waiting since there's a more attractive 15 minute waiting time now. Uh, we've nearly done the revenue that we did yesterday. And we've nearly caught all the passengers. Gotta watch these coming in. Not having enough fuel in them. No, no, we're back to 120 minute waiting time. Oh my god. You know, I can take a hit on the I can take a hit on the service center. We can take a hit on the service center, no problem. I really can. At the end of the day, this is just this is just generate revenue. This is this is revenue. Do we more at a supermarket? I don't think you do. Someone that used to work at a supermarket. You don't earn that much. So we can earn that. We should be able to buy our extra bus back. Oh, it cost us five grand to it. See, I don't like the idea of the fact that those buses have nothing left to do and they're just going to wait there until um, they're just going to wait there for what you call it for a while I love the fact that we just we brought 10 grand in and fine to passengers which is brilliant because that's just paying the wage bill Forty minutes to come down. I didn't think we cancelled any tours. A lot of it is about the driver's style in it, which will go up. Friendliness we can't really do it about at the moment. Because we can't really choose to be picky. We can make these guys work their asses off though. Yes! We unlock the bronze medal. Right, silver trophies to earn 1,000. Carry, catch 500 passengers without tickets. We're halfway there. That's fine. 100 trophies. Create three bus routes and regularly use buses on the routes. 13 days remaining. That's fine. We're going to have to get there on that one. Uh, we've got a third bus route. We have got a third bus route. We just need um, buses to support that route. Holy cow. Right, what can we do that doesn't cost us anything? 
definitely that one. Uh, I want to go for the ticket inspector stuff, but these guys are working like. I'm just going to close it because they're going to be working on life. Well, they got to advanced skill. Finance wise, we brought in 11 grand, 20,000 in subsidies, 11,000 thousand pounds for environmental causes. So our staff costs, costs are just about covered by our fines, repair and maintenance, fuel, electricity, bus stops, those new bus stops, weren't it? Uh, yeah, loans. So yeah. A lot of drivers complain about pay. We need to be cleaned. We definitely need to be cleaned and washed. We need to be cleaned and washed. You're gaining your mileage back. Right, so on that bombshell, we will make this the end of the episode and we'll see you in the next one. Hope you enjoyed and see you soon.